Hello and welcome back to Nerdy Nerds. Today we have received a special delivery. That, of course, is the special delivery Charizard. Now I'm going to get over into the corner in a sec and show you guys the card. But I've also got a couple packs to open because I had to spend £20 to get it. So I went and spent £20 and got it. And I also got a couple of the, uh, the McDonald's Happy Meals packs to open as well because I'm really curious what's inside there. So I'm not going to waste any time. Let's get over to the corner and have a little look at this special delivery Charizard. Also, guys, we're going to be giving away a copy of Violet or Scarlet on the release day of the games to one of you lucky guys. But all you have to do first is subscribe to the channel and put on notifications so that you guys get notified when we do the giveaway video. But yeah, let's get on with the video. <laughs> Then here we have the packs we're going to open today. I will open these right after I show you the Charizard, but let me explain what we're opening. So we got three of the McDonald's Happy Meal packs. These were, again, limited to two, but I bought a Happy Meal, so I got three. And then we were allowed three of each of these. We weren't allowed any more. I was just going to get Evolving Skies, to be honest, but because I was only allowed three, I thought, chuck in some brilliant stars. So let's get into these in just a second, but let me show you this now this is the special delivery charizard now have a little gander at him i wasn't sure if it was going to be holographic i thought maybe it wasn't but it is holographic and to be fair this one these sides look good everything seems to look pretty good i'm not going to take it out of the uh, the pack but it, i can't see what the back looks like so i assume the back's good but there it is it, it finally came out i'm not sure what set it was that had this inside the booklet and uh, for years, I've, uh, I think two years, this has been rumoured. And finally, it is here and we've all got our hands on it. And I don't know how many people have actually got it. It seems like a fair chunk, but it does also seem like they turned off the uh, the submissions for it quite early. So I'm not sure how many people did get their hands on it, but it's selling for stupid amounts online, to be honest. But I assume that's going to come down very, very soon. But now let's get into the packs. I'm going to start off with the McDonald's packs because I really have no idea what's in there. And I've only got the Rowlet ones. So excuse me. I know there is other ones. I think they've released the Growlithe one as well now. Um, I don't know what all of this stuff is. I'm going to throw away the box two seconds. Um, what is it? Is it a little spinner thing? Should I build this right now? I don't think we're going to build this right now. But I'm not really 100% sure what's happening. Um, what does this say? So... Uh, is that all you have to do? In, in all honesty, if that's as easy as it is, that's, that, I'll do that. I'm okay with that. Chuck you in there. Slippy, slippy. Is that going on? Have I done this right? I think I've done it right. That is right. Bam. So, oh, right. Spin it. You can't see me spinning it. Let me turn this up a sec. Spinning. Oh, my God. There's not enough room here. Right, it spins. I, I, it also lands on things so... This one means I've got to weigh myself. I, I don't want to do that. So let's throw these away. A few little coins there. I mean, that is cool. Very nice and very cool. But also, uh, a bit, I mean, you're not going to put plastic ones inside the uh, inside the McDonald's hat meals. But here is the little pack. Now, I've got Pikachu on it. Match battle. I don't know if these have anything special, if they're reprints or what now these are paper so it always scares me oh we got a big team right there and it's holographic are they all holographic i know the uh the 25th anniversary ones were right so no they weren't i'm lying no they're not gonna be yeah of course right okay so there's four cards because the holographic's on top every time i assume there's no point in doing well there isn't a point in doing card trick i don't know what i'm talking about but there's no point in me uh trying to hide it i'm just gonna show it every time i assume Unless we can try and hide it. Should we try and hide it? Come on, let's try and hide it. Right, bam. Take him out. Do the card trick, which would be one to the back. Ooh, we're doing a proper card trick. Right, there's a Ladybat. A Lapras. A Beware. And a... Oh, there's a Pikachu. Now, Pikachu always goes for the best when it comes to these sets. I know the Pikachu from the 25th anniversary was selling quite well. I don't know about any of the other ones, but I assume they're doing quite well. Let's check them all together to the back. And let's get into the third one. Right, I assume... It's going to be same again. I don't know what the uh, what the the pulls are. I don't know how many cards are actually in this little set. I assume it's very very small. 
But I haven't, there's no little booklet that tells us what cards are in this set. That'd be quite handy, to be honest. Right. Lady Bear, I wonder if it's the same thing again. So, no, it's not, but Pikachu, it is Pikachu. Aha, so it started with Lady Bear, and it was Pikachu again. I wonder, I wonder if there's some, there's some thing to that. Like, there's like a little way of knowing what you're going to get, because they have an order. Probably not, and probably just pure coincidence, but let's get into... The actual ballista packs. Now these, I've, I've heard these are really, really lucky. I couldn't tell you if they actually are any luckier than any of the other packs that you usually get. But apparently they are. So this is the first time I think I've ever opened a ballista pack. Maybe once before. I don't, I, I can't recall ever opening one. But if I've ever opened one on the channel, I'll have to look back and see if I have. Let's get into the first brilliant stars. Now... This set has looked up recently for me. It's been better. Is, is it three or four? Why am I thinking it's four? It is four. It is four. What am I doing? Right. So, Crawdaunt. Completely forgot how to open Pokemon cards. It was a Pokemon McDonald's. Uh, not, oh, my God. I can't speak. McDonald's ones that threw me off. Right. Ready? First pack. Nothing. So, so far, it's not showing me the luck. But let's go into Evolving Skies. Now, I assume Evolving Skies is going to be a little bit better. The, uh, the booster boxes apparently, apparently have got worse with the pull rates. I remember when I first opened it, the pull rates were a bit disgusting, to be honest with you. I got ridiculous, uh, ridiculous pulls for the first few times. I don't know if it's maybe after the initial print run, they got people really hooked onto it. Um, and then realised that maybe they were being a bit too generous and have slowed it down slightly. But, can we get a Rayquaza? Alter that? We got it. Holographic, okay. It's not, it's not perfect, but it technically counts as something. I'm not going to scream and shout about it and tell my friends, but we got a holographic. It's the start of something, but can we improve on that? we got a Charizard pack and Brilliant Stars. I hope so. And remember, guys, if you want to win or have a chance at winning the, uh, the new Scarlet and Violet games, make sure you subscribe. We'll be doing the giveaway video literally in November when the games come out, so we can give it straight to someone. Are you ready for this? Holographic again. Okay, we're, we're, we're being more appreciative of the holographics, right? We've still got two Evolving Skies and one more Brilliant Stars. So Brilliant Stars has one more chance to give us something worth screaming about. Right. Umbreon pack. Try and get... To be honest with you, the Umbreon alternate art would be, would be nice. But I want the Rayquaza. I really want that Rayquaza. Right, come on. Braviary, Switching Cups, Slackoth. Come on. Give us something. That's the same Pikachu. It is. It's the same Pikachu. Look. What's the odds? I didn't realise it was going to... That's, that's mad, that is. I didn't buy this, uh, this set on purpose. Okay. Okay. Full art. I'll take a full art. I've probably got it. But a full art nonetheless. We'll take that. That is... Out of three, well, out of two so far, that is pretty good. That is definitely the best pull of the video. Now, Brilliant Stars has one more chance to trump it. Can it trump it? Right. One, two, three, and four. Get into this one. Right. We're looking for Charizard and Venusaur having a scrap. They'll change everything. They'll make this the best set on the planet. It didn't do anything for us. Right. Okay. So, Brilliant Stars was a fail, but... Evolving Skies. Evolving Skies is going to be the one. Last pack. Sylveon pack. Can we get an alternate art? And there's that Pikachu again. Ooh, can we get an alternate art, please? I would love it. I would appreciate it very much. I think we're going to get nothing but... It's all fingers crossed. Right, the last pack of the video. We saw ourselves a special delivery. Charizard. Can we get an alternate art Rayquaza? Can I get... Bug at all. Absolutely nothing. Right, okay. So the best card of the video. It was only a short and sweet one, but we got ourselves a Trevenant full art. That'll do. That'll do. And a cheeky little Pikachu for the McDonald's. We got two of these. I feel like this one is actually a little bit special, but then we found the Pikachu in the Evolving Sky, so eh, less special. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel to give yourself a chance at winning the new Scarlet or Violet. Ladies and gentlemen, have a good night. Cheers. If you enjoyed that video, why not subscribe? If you enjoyed that video, why not subscribe? It'll help me and Natty continue to do the work that we're doing, and hopefully you'll enjoy it. Thanks!